ました。I'm such a slow loser. The fact is, many bariatric patients lose more than 100 pounds within the first year. Some patients lose even more weight two years post op, and some may even lose in excess of 200 pounds. The reality is, results will vary from patient to patient. You've heard it before. If you haven't, everybody is different. Weight loss will be determined by many factors. Some of those include, most of them include, With you personally, what other medical conditions are you challenged with? What is your medical history? What is your eating relationship before having weight loss surgery? What procedure are you having? How much weight do you have to lose? Your age, your gender, and many more factors. The best results with long term weight loss success c o m e s to those who are committed to behavior modifications. And lifestyle changes way beyond when we stop losing weight from the surgery procedure. You always have to remember weight loss surgery is not a quick fix, it isn't a miracle cure, and you're not gonna lose weight overnight. Some people lose weight super fast, some at a slow and steady pace, some with many stalls and plateaus, which I'm going to hear to remind you is very normal and should be expected. It's super important to set realistic weight loss goals from the very beginning. A loss of about two to three pounds per week is something that is probably an average weight loss. Some people experience a pound a week, and some at the very beginning, probably due to how much weight they have to lose, could even be a pound a day. But as I said, Please know that stalls, weight loss, even slowdown, and possibly a little gain is normal and part of the journey. The ideal is steady, slow weight loss. For the best results, follow the advice of your surgeon and nutritionist post op. I encourage you to join a support group. Support groups will provide you with additional advice, suggestions. Motivation and so much more. Remember, it is a journey, not a straight line. Surgery is one tool in the toolbox. If you combine them with other skills that you develop over time post surgery, your best results will be long term success. Focus on all the other non scale victories and indicators of progress and success. Some of those include inches lost, how do you feel, your energy level. Your lab work? Have you reduced any of those other medical concerns that you were having? So much more. If you're willing to commit to lifestyle changes, behavior modifications, and developing those life skills to help you do, like, just navigate through everyday life without turning to food, coping with food, these individuals will have the most successful weight loss. As well as long term results. I get it. Are you stalled or maybe hit a plateau, slow down your weight loss, or even a little regain? It's okay. I'm here to tell you it's normal, it's part of the process. If you want some additional help, please check out my video on weight loss, surgery, plateaus, and stalls, and how to break through. Mm-hmm.